what's up YouTube welcome back to another video today we're out at Big Springs MX um, it's an absolute gorgeous day out here it's a little bit chilly um, I already got the bike all unloaded up and uh, yeah I'm just gonna get geared up I'm currently actually out here by myself today uh, the group went to McClarty um, but I just decided I want to stay local go to Big Springs and um, yeah so I don't know how much third-person footage I'm gonna get if any but like always, I'm gonna do the best I can for you guys. And uh, yeah, just give you guys the best video possible. But with that said, I'm gonna go take a look at the track, see what kind of riders we got out there, get geared up. And uh, yeah, go out there for my first moto. All right, what's up guys? Just coming at to you um, a few motos later and I'll be completely honest, I had a gnarly get off on one of the new doubles. Um, I took the inside line and the left side of the jump was like a like a pretty deep drop down there and the, li the line I took, um, I hit something or it just bugged my bike weird and it sent me off the track and I just went over the bars and went off the jump um, down there in that gully. Um, as you can see the bike, I mean, it's not terrible. The bars were super bent up, but uh, I got my T-wrenches out and uh, fixed it up as good as it's gonna get. Radiators are fine, everything's fine. I think I got it back to normal, but you can definitely tell that um, something isn't right. Um, I definitely have a bruise on my chest and on my left arm, and I got a gnarly scrape on my back. I can definitely feel it, but uh, yeah, I think I got the bike back rideable again, so I'm gonna throw the GoPro on. You know, I haven't really got much footage up at this point, so I'm gonna throw the GoPro on, try to get back out there, and uh, yeah, maybe take it a little bit more easy than I usually do, because I'm not trying to end up on the ground again. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna throw the GoPro on. Hopefully get some more footage. I might be the only one out there, which might be a good thing. Um, but uh, yeah, um, hopefully I won't have another wreck. I was kind of bummed I didn't have the GoPro on for when I wrecked the first time, but hopefully I won't have to go through that again, but I'm gonna get the GoPro thrown on and uh, yeah, try to get some kind of riding footage for you guys. I don't know if you can tell, if you guys can tell if the bars are bent or not, but they're definitely not perfect, that's for sure. So this is the jump that I had to get off on. I just went off to that left side over there. Suck.
all right guys that's gonna wrap it up for today got the bike and everything all loaded up uh i hope you guys like this video um i definitely am in a lot of pain after that last moto golly my hair is crazy right now um yeah it took everything in me to go out there and do that last moto um but it was fun i had a great time and uh joel put on a great track for today best as he could for the weather conditions it's been freezing cold the ground has been freezing and that just dries it out um so uh yeah and big shout out to him he literally just left me here like i'm the last one here and he just said leave whenever i want to and just lock up so that's really cool of him he's like the coolest track owner you'll ever meet if you've met him you know exactly what i'm talking about but uh yeah guys i'm gonna cap the video off here if you liked it subscribe and uh, I wish I'd have got the wreck on GoPro, but unfortunately I didn't. I was contemplating even riding anymore after I wrecked, but I was like, you know what? It's still early. I don't even have any footage. And uh, yeah, so I got the bar straight and uh, went back out there. And I definitely rode a little bit more cautious that time. But yeah, had overall had a fun day. It's about time that I broke this bike in, I guess. And uh, yeah, I'm definitely gonna definitely gonna be sore in the morning but you know it's part of the sport but uh yeah guys hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys on the next video